everyone! Welcome to Southern Delight. I am Debbie and today we are going to be taking a Dollar Tree shadow box and turning it into one of these which is full of snow. My husband and I just got back from a trip to the mountains and um, we saw snow so we took a couple of photos and I thought it would be really cute to put this with some of my Christmas decor that I have going on in my living room. If you've been following me, you know that I have transformed my living room into a cozy Christmas cottage used red and black buffalo print. So I thought it would be really cute to have some pictures to go along with it. So what I did was I got some of our mountain pictures and we're fixing to turn these shadow boxes into shadow boxes full of snow. So what we're going to do is take this little item that I picked up. First we're going to pop off this back and get the stars out. And I'm going to save these stars for another project. Always come in handy around graduation or anytime you want to do things for when people make achievements and so forth. Let's come in handy. So we're going to dump those in a Ziploc bag and put them aside. All right. We've got everything we need, but you'll need a shadow box and you'll also need to get some fake snow. They sell this at the Dollar Tree as well. And I also picked up one of these Dollar Tree ornaments. And what I'm going to do is pop off this little metal piece here and then use this greenery later on in our project. So I printed out some of these pictures. This is a four by six. And it's snugly in there. And the board here has two little holes in it. What I did was I took it, I just went ahead and cut that middle piece out. Kind of gives me a template to go by. Okay. And then we've got this. And we're going to be taking and cutting this into the shape of that. So I want it to go around. we're going to take and trace around the back of this so I can cut out the inner part of it. It's just always easier if you have a, you trace it out. Okay, take our scissors. What I've done is I've traced around it and trimmed it all out. This is what we're looking at here. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some hot glue, take that down. We're going to pop this little piece off of the ornament. We're going to use it. And this has a cute little reindeer on it. We're going to take and pop this little piece off as well. They're little metal pieces, so pop it off. We're going to take some glue. I'm going to glue this right here on the side and right up there. Okay. Let's let that hot glue gun heat up, and then I'm going to glue this. Got the mat glued on got the reindeer glued on and the greenery. And as far as um, this little mat, what I did was I went into um, just Google and did a search um, for, you can search for clip art background. I just put in buffalo print and then I printed off some of these. You can use wrapping paper for this project as well. If you have like a favorite print, um, just print it out. But this just so happened they, they had it there and I have a color copier and so I just printed me off some of these and it matches perfectly with um, all my decor that I got going on. All right for the fake snow I need a warning label on this. I have these little snowballs everywhere. You probably already picked up. I have them all scattered across here. But um, I'm going to put in, I was going to tell you by tablespoon, but 
we're going to fill up like this bottom rim area up to about right there. But this is all up to personal preference, how much of it you want. But I think that's pretty good for us. And we'll reseal this in a minute. And then all you have to do is just lay this back in there. And it should just pop in real easily and secure it. And then voila, you have a snow shadow box. And I did these as matching pairs because like I said, this is what we're decorating in in our living room. This was under $2 and it took me under 10 minutes to make. These also make perfect Christmas gifts. I know my mother, um, they're wanting pictures of us and um, they say they never can get enough pictures of us or whatever, but these make really great Christmas gifts as well. Um, even for best friends and you know things like that because if you have a cute little um, selfie together or something they make wonderful little gifts but I thought I'd just pass it along share that idea with you but if you like what you see if you'll go down below and um, click that subscribe button and that way you can see all my videos and um, also if you'll put some likes or comments down below that way I can I'll know a little bit of what you're thinking about my videos I'm a little new at all of this and I'm still learning and um, I could use some tips and so forth. So if you have comments for me, just put them down below. Thank you.